As child surveyors, we offer building surveys and schedules and conditions and schedules and dilapidations on offices, shops and other commercial buildings. As a tenant moving into a building, you'd want to know the condition of the property before you take on the liability of a lease. This can be established through a building survey or a schedule of condition. These two forms of reports provide a good benchmark and a record of what the property was like when you took the lease on. During the course of the lease, you may find that the landlord will serve a schedule of dilapidations on you. Dilapidation refers to the disrepair or identification of a defect in a property or the breach of a covenant in the lease which has legal liability. These dilapidations may actually come towards the end of the lease, but having this record through either a building survey or a schedule condition will provide some protection to you as a tenant. But also from the landlord's perspective, it will also provide a record, a fair record, of what the property is like and how far he can pursue a tenant in terms of getting certain repairs done. Whether we're acting for the landlord or the tenant, it is our role to look at three things. First of all, the lease. Secondly, the property. And third, to identify any breach of a covenant. When undertaking an inspection in a dilapidations claim, I'll be cross-checking the condition of the property with those repairing covenants in the lease. In the case of a full repairing and insuring lease, this would involve me checking anything from a structural problem to damp ingress to condition of decorations, as well as checking the services. At Woodward Child Surveyors, we offer services for both tenants and landlords. You can find out further information on our website. Good luck in your commercial venture. <laughs>